The other day I was just in my van gaming at my computer like I always do. And then I heard something. It sounded like scratching. The same sound that I heard when I was lying asleep the night beforehand. And as I listened closer, I realized that it was coming from one of my cabinets. So, me being curious, I quickly opened the cabinet, and there it was. Immediately, I got my friends to come inside the van to see what I had found inside of one of my cabinets, and there it was, staring right into my soul. One of the cutest little intruders I've ever seen in my entire life. It was a mouse scrounging for his next meal. Buddy. He's in your, he's in your thing. He's in my water bottle? Yep, got it. Oh, oh my God. No. No. Freak. No way. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so cute. Hold on. He's so cute. And thankfully he made his way into one of my water bottles that was in my cabinet, so it was fairly easy to capture him. However, my friend Sarah thought it was a really good idea because he was such a cute little intruder to give him a little carrot. And <laughs> when we gave him that carrot, the water bottle was open. So that little rascal took that opportunity to make a run for it. Hey buddy, I'm gonna okay. slide this down for ya. One carrot. Oh my gosh, that was the worst thing that could have ever happened. And you all might be thinking that this might be the end of this mouse's story. However, it's not at all. <laughs> Somehow, some way, this mouse found its way back into my van and he continues to keep me up at night by scratching around as he builds his bed behind the walls of my van. <sighs> and today, I've had enough of it. So I'm playing landlord and I'm cracking down on my new neighbor because homies stay in here rent free. And you know, we can't have that. This epic montage is brought to you by Skillshare. I've been slacking a lot on my self-care and overall wellness lately due to the amount of stress that comes with being a content creator. But by using Skillshare as a way to invest in myself by attending unique classes like Science-Based Body Weight Workout Build Muscle Without a Gym by Felix Harder, I've been able to learn so many new skills to help take better care of myself and put more value into my life. Skillshare has so many unique classes like graphic design, web development, filmmaking, and they even have a step-by-step -step guide to van life. And if you want to try Skillshare out for yourself, the first 1,000 people to click the link in the description of this video will get a one-month free trial to all these awesome, unique, cool, and informative classes that they have to offer. Okay, it's finally time to capture this dirty little rascal. And the game plan is to capture him as humanely as possible. I don't want to have to kill him if I don't have to. So 
I made this makeshift trap earlier today and basically it's just a soda bottle that's attached to a piece of wood that's on a pivot and the plan is to fill this bottle with peanut butter to lure him inside of the bottle and once he goes to the back of the bottle fills his little tummy up with peanut butter and decides to go back in his nest deep into my walls of my van as he walks to the entryway of the soda bottle his weight will pivot the bottle down and boom, the cap will block off the entryway, making the mouse unable to leave the bottle. And hopefully, by the time I wake up in the morning, this little dude would have found himself in a sticky situation, stuck in his bottle, and I can safely remove him from the van, lure him far away from the van in a field somewhere in a far away distance, so he can go do mouse things somewhere else outside of my van. Okay, so we've got my night vision camera up right here looking directly towards the mouse trap with the night vision on and everything set up. So I'm gonna let this run throughout the night as I go to bed and hopefully when I wake up in the morning there's gonna be a mouse trapped in this really fancy mouse trap. And if there's not, I'm gonna be really upset. <laughs> I really hope this freaking works because I do not want a mouse in my van anymore. Good morning, everyone. It is a beautiful, wonderful day. It's been a couple days since I've filmed, and that's mainly because I've just been trying to catch this mouse that's in my van, and I've had zero luck. Until last night, when I was deep in a slumber, I heard a lot of ruckus going on in my cabinet. So I got up, and I looked, and there he was trapped in my makeshift mouse trap. Okay, so now comes the easy slash still kind of hard part, which is picking up this mouse trap to take him out of the van. Because the way that I designed this mouse trap, if I were to pick up this board, the bottle, since it's on a pivot, would just tip down and dump the mouse out onto my countertop or on my floor, which would be the worst thing possible. So when I go to take him out of the van, I'm gonna have to hold the bottle in place so he stays in there, which is gonna be kind of tough. Okay, we got him. We got him. Oh, oh freak. Okay, I think this is probably far enough away from the van that we will never see this little dude ever again. Which is a little disheartening because he's a cute little mouse. I'm gonna miss you, bud. But it's time for us to say goodbye. But don't be too sad because think of this as a new chapter, a new life. This forest is your new home. And there's so much out here for you, man. There's unlimited water. There's probably so much food out here. 
You're gonna make so many new friends. Heck, you may even start a family out here. Idaho's beautiful, man. You're gonna love it, because I know I do. All right, moment of truth. We're gonna let this little guy out. All right, guy, it was nice meeting you. Let's, uh, I'll see you next time. Come on, go, go, get out, get out. Go, 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 go. Go, you can do it. Come on, little buddy. St go start your new life. There he goes, there he goes. Have fun, have fun, little dude. Well, there he goes. Off to start his new life. <sighs> Man, it's been a crazy past few days trying to capture this mouse. <laughs> Took me days to capture this dude. But we finally did it. And I'm glad I didn't have to kill him. I'm glad we could just capture him and set him free in this new home, in this beautiful forest. I'm confident he's gonna love it here. It's gonna be much cozier than my van. And when I was doing my research trying to capture this dude, I found that having mice in your van is a fairly common problem. A lot of people that live in vans have mice issues. So keep that in mind if you are planning to live out of a van, you're more than likely gonna have a surprise waiting on you behind the walls. <laughs> and if you're currently living in a van with some mice issues, hopefully this video was informative for you and will help you capture your own van mouse. <laughs> and if it was informative, you should let me know by liking, commenting, subscribing, and turning on all notifications so you don't miss out on any of my future uploads. But with that being said, everybody, that's it for today's video. Thank you all for watching. I've got nothing else to say. I'm just happy there's no more m mice in my van. <laughs> All right, you guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time.